Hey everybody, Kuzmos here, back again with the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. We've returned to sort of our regular schedule. For the time being, we're just heading around the ring, giving everybody a play, and now it's time for Magdalene. As always, not my favorite character, but, ugh, really? I mean, maybe it'll provide some minuscule benefit. Um, that was a terrible idea. I was hoping it'd pay off with something. You know, get a little bit of extra headway. Well, we got a penny out of this room at least. Alright, so there goes uh, Maggie's extra survivability. Hopefully, however, some of the improved charge mechanics will help us survive a little better while we still have the Yum Heart. Key one, of course, the fact that items recharge two charges on a large room. A room like this that's not exceptionally difficult is great for us. Right, so there's one more enemy hanging around, I'm assuming. Yep, and there's the doors open. Two more rooms, and we can heal, yay! Alright, let's not worry about the neutral flies right off the bat. Come on. Okay. There's a marked rock, we're so we're looking for a bomb for ourselves. That worked excellently. Um... On the off chance, there's a super secret room there. And there is. Don't take that yet. Okay. Got a black heart in there. So if we get any kind of pills or... There we go. There's full hearts. And famine. I'm reasonably okay with a familiar of some sort. And we will have actually a ton of soul hearts. I think this famine drops them. And we've got two from our marked rock. And we have the black rock. Black rock. Black heart in our super secret room. Vungus go up. Okay, that's okay. Getting hit here is fine. I mean, I prefer not to be, but it doesn't rob us of a devil deal. Goodness, you are a very charged fellow today, aren't you, sir? Okay, there we go. Off with your head. Well, both off with your body. Well, the head came off, too. It's just... We got rid of the body. Anyways, right. Trying and failing and bungling Alice in Wonderland references. Oops. Shouldn't have got the hit there. Remarkably, we are done. Be careful there. Alright, so this will give us a total of four soul hearts. That is amazing. Very well. Three soul, one black. So, how do I feel with this floor? I mean, for what it did for us immediately, it's kind of meh. Uh, we can get a heal off of that. I don't really care about that anymore. I'm hoping to not need healing anymore. Oh, well, you know that was dumb, but it took care of him, didn't it? Death will be great for a large room, more than likely. There we go. You just hang there. We still have no keys, a fact which I just now noticed. We'll wait to go in that room. And we have so many places to use our bomb. And we chose wrong. I don't know if it actually would make a difference if we blew up the other one. But I feel like it would. Alright. Got our first key, which we do not want to use on the chest, as much as I'm curious as to what's in there. We're also looking for more bombs. Tech. Yeah, okay, I like tech. Uh, we're a bit slow firing right now, but not too bad. Our damage should be the same, just 
applied over a larger area, basically. Like here, we can take those three out at once. I don't think there's any way to hit both of those. That's all right. And actually, I can. Did I take him? Yeah, I did. I'm gonna shoot these fires out. I should be trying to hurry, just in case. I am able to get to boss rush with Maggie. And I also do find it drastically easy. Oh, let's go ahead and pop that. Drastically easier to hit with just the straight laser shot. As opposed to, you know, the tears, which take a bit of time to get there. This is pretty much instant. I don't know if it's truly instantaneous. It also kind of wobbles there, which I think is an improvement over what it used to be. I'm guessing that actually essentially gives it a larger hitbox, or that may just be an animation to account for it having a larger hitbox. I think I might be tempted to just kind of... Uh, not yet. I'm not brave enough yet. Alright, you jump. Do a little scatter. If I can get... Oh, I am terrible at this. There we go. Just wait till he gets into position. There we go. Yeah, I got... Oops. Okay, I sort of have it down. Well, that is a completely worthless upgrade. That is... Actually, probably very, very bad for us. We don't have enough keys. And that's the end of this floor, so... We've got Devil Deals, but we are, we've drastically minimized the amount of keys we're going to get. I'm going to come, come in here. Uh, that will all be worth it if I can get Guppy. Probably. Uh, that was actually pretty fortunate. But more than anything, I need to get I desperately need keys, so despite the fact that we're going to be getting chests, I need to make certain I have enough keys for our item rooms. Case in point, there we go. Another worthless upgrade. Range and piercing. The laser already pierces and has effectively infinite range. I'm pretty certain there is an exception, but until that comes up, as far as I'm concerned, it has infinite range. Alright. Taking some terrible damage here. I am atrocious at fighting spiders. That went pretty well, however. Alright, got some good damage on some doubles there. Just don't dodge, don't uh, don't dodge them. Don't dodge them. There's just stand in place. And that was... Honestly, pure luck. Yeah, as much as I'd like to claim otherwise. Alright. Another bomb. Some money. Ooh. I was about to just run right into that bomb. That would have been terrible. And let's go ahead and fight our boss. Ooh. Uh, mixed feelings on this boss. It is a segmented boss, so I think our laser should work pretty well against it. On the other hand, it's just all around a very tough boss. Uh, stand back. Now, if we can get it to jump straight at us, we're doing pretty well, I think. Now it gets dangerous. That was only the first phase. I'm assuming those are spectral. Oh, gosh. And it does that. That laser is just... Ugh, I don't... I don't know if I can do this without losing our... Come on, there we go. Okay, damage is great. Uh, we are not going to be powerful enough for a boss rush attempt, I don't think. Just judging from where we are right now with two wasted items and a third item which is subpar at best. Alright, an extra key, so it's 
surprisingly, we're still doing pretty good on the key front. Uh, even if I get a gold chest, I... You know what, I will probably, in fact, open it. Um, just hoping that I can keep up keys. I'm doing so... doing well so far. Uh, you, sir. I would appreciate it if you would die. Alright, certain I have issues with this hitbox. Just with this guy in particular. Come on. I can't get up to him to do the... There we go. Yeah, since he explodes, I can't really afford to hit him with the cube of meat. There's someone else summoning something up here somewhere. Alright, that went pretty well. Um, drop that there, this here. Alright. Pull that up, get our four cents. Get ourselves some more soul hearts. Yeah, bomb for four cents is, uh, I suppose decent. Obviously, it'd be better to, uh, come on, come on, come on. I don't know if that was worth it or not. We got a bomb and some money. Really, the if it's worth it or not comes down almost entirely, I would imagine, to whether or not we can get enough keys in the future. I should shoot these. But I'm not going to shoot both of them. Are you running slow enough as is? Alright, here's hoping our next item is more worthwhile. Got ourselves a lovely long room. Charge me, come on. One more time. Okay, now it's getting dangerous. There we go. If I can get close enough to do that. Oh, kind of had a feeling that would happen. Okay. Give me... Okay, sure, money. You know what? I've got the heart that I'm not really doing anything with. So I will give my... Well, I can't do anything with that. That did not make two plays. Alright, excellent. That increases our damage a little bit. And... Ooh, more stuff to do with my health. Excellent. Probably. Definitely. Awesome. Okay. That didn't work so well. Heal up a little bit. Alright, as much as I'd like those coins, I think we're... Hmm, maybe I can get a heart from this. Uh, this is risky. Actually, I think what I would prefer... If I just toss a bomb in there... Okay, two bombs. There we go, that was a little more worthwhile. Again, though, two bombs are five cents. That's... Kind of a questionable value prospect there. However, I think we'll be fine. Oh, be careful here, though. Try to keep spiders off of her back. And get... Kind of a foothold here. Uh-oh. Or, you know, get hit, lose a black heart, and... Just roll with that. So I think we're down to one route available. Twelve minutes on Catacombs 2. Hmm, oop. Alright, we can handle this with ease. And that is, again, something that... ...rather wants us to have flying. Or give up a black heart. Probably two black hearts. Nah, eh, maybe not. Yeah, we could do it with just one, maybe some bombs, but... 
I don't think with us not knowing what's in there, it's just worthwhile. It could be something good. But... For the time being, we'll hold on to the High Priestess. Hopefully not get stepped on. Okay, we can do this. I might have keys. That's not a key. Oh! Did that... No, Fairmont's always affected everything in the room. Oh, that is a scary attack. Please do not. I do not like the little red Mega Fatty. Uh, range on this attack isn't bad, but this attack straight up scares me. He also seems to jump a lot less. I wonder if I can lure him on to his own red poop. Uh, probably the High Priestess would have been worth it here. Dang it. But didn't he just suck back in his own bullets? It's kind of an inch. Oh, come on, that was just bad. Alright, ooh. Got some new attacks going here. Let's get this damage in here as quick as possible. Oh no, okay, we're about to die. We're about, we're dead. <sighs> well. Didn't last as long as it hoped. But lasted a little too long to start again. Nonetheless, hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. But, until next time, catch you later.